M0FXB, the new Anytone 890 UV. Let's turn on Digi Monitor. This is going to allow all talk groups through, all color codes through, and both time slots. So when you preset a channel, it will sort of select which ones it's going to let through. You're effectively just saying no, let everything through just so you can listen. So all you do is go menu, go down to uh, settings and then radio set and we're going to let a button so key function of these buttons um, become the on off of digimonitor so we're going to go key function and choose pf1 short which is the one underneath the ptt short press select and then we're just going to look for digimonitor okay in the very long list um, keep going look at all these things that it does uh, Digi, <laughs> come on, am I going too fast? Digi monitor, there it is, number 20, is that 29? Select. So now you've got two selections here. So we're going to press it and you'll see a little red, it looks like a speaker, although it's not a speaker, but it looks like a speaker. So we're going to press it, Digi monitor double slot. So that's going to let through time slot one and two. And I'm not sure why it hasn't gone red there. It could be that we're not in, an, in, um, digital mode let's try it a minute so I've set a button to take us from um, digital to analog mode so digital select again you set a button so that's DMR there look um, set a button to it and choose analog or digital and we've chosen digital and now it's appeared and there's two little lines there uh, that says that it's letting both time slots through one and two if you're not familiar with time slots when they designed the DMR system they were trying to make the most of the channel so they divided it and it's a more technical than this into two halves and um, so that you could let on one half you could have voice on the other half you could have data and vice versa so effectively you got two channel two people two radios two lots of people can use one channel very clever and from a business point of view I completely get it so if we just press the digi monitor button again off it goes completely off now it should yeah, single slot, there you go, and then double slot. So that is basically Digimonitor, and most people want to use that, and there is a loose term called promiscuous mode. Many radios have it, but they don't always let through as much as the Anytones do, and this is going to work on your Anytone 86A, 87A, and this new model, 890, which uh, the main thing about the new model is you've got NXDN coming, firmware but you've also got dual receive which is quite a biggie so if you have say two meters 145 megahertz on the a band and 430 something megahertz on the b you're going to hear them both and that's very good thanks for watching my youtube videos on the anytone 890 878 bye for now